I guess the key is, do you want to see it out the windshield or fly over? Sean Langdon, working, of course, with the folks at CMR Construction and Roofing. He is part of Team Toyota, Gazoo Racing, Mac Tools, Sealmaster, Rev Kim. They got a bunch of folks here this weekend. And Josh Hart runs a company called Bernie Speed Shop down in Ocala, Florida. Home of another pretty famous drag racer that got a pretty cool museum down there. You, 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 you might have heard of Don Garlitz. Don Garlitz is really high on Josh Hart. And if you've been following him the last couple of years, you'll know why. Ron Douglas, tuner of record for the RL Carriers Machine. Still a great race car all throughout qualifying. Sean Langdon coming out of the number five qualifying spot. They stepped it up in round number one. Now, both of these drivers, you may recall, won their first round races on a hole shot. Let's see who gets off the starting line here first, because that might just play the difference in the end. Josh Hart with an 026. Come on, man. Reaction time. Looks like he laid her in there a little bit. 379 at 330 miles an hour. Langdon puffed the tire out there. Goes 469 at 160 miles an hour, but an 026. Are you kidding me? Reaction time for Josh Hart. What have you been hanging out with Justin Ashley? Man, 379 3, 330 for the win. Josh Hart punches his ticket into the semifinals. Down to Joe. Douglas, you guys are going to the semifinal, and you got down the racetrack here as it's getting a little hotter. Yeah, it's tricky, but, uh, you know, the. The, the lanes are negotiable on both sides, and we're just uh, thankful for all the all the uh, people that are out here, the fans, RL carriers supporting us, and we'll try to get another round win here. Remember, they made clean runs in all the qualifying sessions, so Ron Douglas may have a little bit better notebook than some of the drivers that didn't get down the racetrack in the heat of the day. 